Hello, my name is Teresa Greenway. With this video series, I will demonstrate step by step how to achieve a crispy blistered crust sourdough bread just like this. Okay, the 20 minutes are up and I'm going to go ahead and divide this dough out. Very nice dough. Make three loaves, about 700 grams a piece. Okay, there we go. Now try to keep the, the skin that's already formed on the outside. Underneath it's a lot rougher. Try to degas the dough a little. If you don't degas the dough a little bit, you can get some pretty large holes inside your final loaf, which some bakers say if it's large enough to hide a mouse, it's poor shaping. Well, so this will be the first shape. Then we'll do a bench rest, come back and do a final shape. Nice dough, full of gas. A bit sticky, not too bad. 68% hydration. Still very workable. Okay, there we have the three loaves. I'll let them set for, oh, maybe 20 minutes. And then we'll come back and we'll put them in their bannetons and put them to rest. Okay, we're ready to round up and do the final shaping using some rice flour here. That will help so that it doesn't make as much of a design uh, when we bake tomorrow. And, and it won't stick to the dough, it won't show too much. Pop any real big bubbles you see on the surface.
sprinkle some flour on the top so that the bag won't stick to it. Cover them all in bags. And they will be refrigerated overnight. Okay, these are going to be refrigerated overnight and then in the morning we'll do a final proof and a bake.